Hello and welcome to Rusty Speeches. Today's video is going to be another skin cover video and the skin I'm going to be making combos for is Aida. Let's get into this video. This video is going to be another skin cover video and this video is going to be the Aida skin which is the newest level up quest pack and it's in the item shop now in the earn levels and unlock rewards section. As you can see here the Aida's level up quest pack. I'll quickly show off the items you can get with it. Basically you have the back bling which you get for completing seven quests which basically pick up seven XP tokens and you unlock the wrap which is Dragon's Honor for picking up 14. The pickaxe is for picking up 21, and then the skin itself has two edit styles, which is the Aida, which is a standard, and then you get the pen and ink style for completing all 28 quests, which are basically at level up tokens, which is around the map, they show where you are. It's pretty easy. I really do like the fact that Epic has been doing these at the start of, you know, Chapter 3. We've had four of them now. We had the Monarch, then we had the Omega Knight, then last season's was the Phantasm, and obviously this one's Aida, so I would say this one's better than the previous, and this is probably one of my favourites. And obviously, you have 1,200 V-Bucks for a skin, which has two edit styles. Obviously, you, obviously if you get all the stuff done, you get a pickaxe with two edits. You get a, you get a pickaxe, you get a wrap, you get a back bling, which has two edit styles, which is pretty cool for 1,200. So, I made 10 combos for the standard style. Let's get into the combos. First combo, I decided to use, obviously, the standard style for the Iada skin. Back bling is a power pack, and the pickaxe is a power slices, which is Lachlan's pickaxe, and his back bling as well. The glider is a beach umbrella because I've been using this quite a lot. I solely put this on for the yellow on the white, which goes quite nicely with the skin. If it had yellow, white, and black, it would be better, but either way, it works nicely. You could always whack on the one shot or any black themed glider you like, but I use the one shot all the time, so I put one switch up and use the beach umbrella. Contrail is satellite from Chapter 2 Season 4's Battle Pass. I'm pretty sure it's Groot's Contrail from that season. Yes, it is. And the wrap I'm using is Ripe, which is probably still the only yellow wrap that I have, so I thought, why not whack it on? This is probably what my, one of my favourite combos that I made for this. Skin in this video. Let's move on to the second combo. I decided to whack on the Pac Man and I'm using the Pac Man edit style. Pickaxe is a 24 karat katana, which is from the Anime Legends pack, and I'm pretty sure is the Anime Midas's pickaxe. And the wrap I'm using is greed, gold, and black. I find the gold and black goes quite nicely because you, you can like, say it's yellow, or you can say it's gold. It both works very nicely, yellow and gold. Let's move on to the third combo, which is the crewmate. I decided to, decided to go with black. You can go with Yellow, you can go with white, they'll all work nicely, but I decided to go with black so I could then use the pickaxe fibro staff, which is part of the original trilogy set, and it is I'm pretty sure it's in one of the bundles. I'm not sure if it's I'm pretty sure it's the Princess Leia bundle and the Han Solo bundle. So, you know, if you picked up that bundle or just picked up the pickaxe itself, it you know works very nicely with the black theme black themed combo I'm trying to make here, obviously with the back bling and the pickaxe, and the rapid side to use was the Boogeyman for black once again. Let's move on to the fourth combo. I decided to whack on the hollow back. And I'm using the exclamation just solely for the yellow. It works pretty nicely. Just whack on any yellow, black, or white themed sticker that you own. They all work very nicely. But besides about this one on, because I find it looks pretty cool. Pickaxe is the Catwoman's grappling claw. I was either going to use this one or the grappling axe, but I decided to stick with the Catwoman's grappling claw because I prefer that over the over the axe at the moment. The grappling axe. And the wrap I'm using is Cameo, which is from Chapter 2, Season 1's Battle Pass. And it's yellow and black. and works very nicely with this skin. Let's move on to the next combo. I decided to whack on the Michonne's Katana as a back bling and also the pickaxe. The wrap I'm using is Sentinel from Chapter 1, Season 9's Battle Pass. Mainly for the white and the gold goes pretty nicely as well. Obviously, it, it looks gold gold and yellow. Work nicely. Obviously, you've got white and you also got black. So, the skin that's pretty easy to make combos with. And the, you know, the extra edit style you get for getting all the 28 level up tokens. It's pretty nice as well, so I'll probably get that done when I uh, when I unlock it later on. Obviously, because we have to wait until obviously all the challenges come out. Back bling is the backstabber for this combo, and I'm using the default color. You can use the black; that works nicely as well. But so to stick with the defaults for like the gold and the black. Pickaxe is the venom. It also has two edit styles. Let's see. You can use fully black out, blacked out if you want, or the black color, or you can stick with the default. I decided to stick with the default, which is yellow and black. This is from a which is from the Team Toxic set, which is basically the Level up the um, starter pack from that's from chapter 2 season 4 season. Obviously, you get a starter pack every season. Obviously, you get 600 free bucks, the skin, and the pickaxe usually. And it's, you know, it works very nicely with the skin. The wrapper wasn't sure, so I just put on the mayhem. Let's move on to the next combo. I whacked on the Jedi Order back bling. And I decided to whack on the Vision pickaxe, which is mainly for the black. It works very nicely with this combo. And I use the Jedi Order quite a lot on the yellow themed skins, and I thought it worked pretty nicely. And the rapid side to go was Cool Sign Hornet, which is from Chapter 1, Season 8. And it's part of the Air Royale set. And back in the day, there's an Air Royale game mode. And you could basically get like a... It was like basically fly around and playing. You basically had to survive and get basically a win. 
and you got like challenges back then, which you could do to get it. So that's obviously if you don't own this weapon, and any, any yellow, black, or white themed weapon wraps that work perfect. Let's move on to the next combo. For this one, I decided to work on the perfect wings. You can work on any white themed wings you like. I was either going to use the perfect wings or the shaft wings. I was also tempted to use the arc wings, but I decided to stick with the perfect wings. I probably say it's my, my favourite white set of wings that I own. Pickaxe is a phantasmic pulse. And for this one, I decided to work on the valiant fire, primary colour black, and secondary colour yellow. Solid because this style, I decided to go for black. Obviously, you have the outfit, the yellow go with the outfit. And also, when you put the Valiant Flame on, there's a little bit of white or like white tinge in it as well. So, you obviously got all colours covered, which is pretty cool. And the wrap I decided to use was Stealth Black, which is pretty short from the Air Royale set. Once again, Chapter 1, Season 8. It's obviously similar to the previous wrap. You got it for doing some Air Royale challenges back in the day. Let's move on to the second last combo. I decided to work on the Training Remote Back Bling, which is from the original trilogy set. And it's from one of the skins in the obviously newest Luke Skywalker, Princess Leia, or Han Solo. I'm not exactly sure. I'm pretty sure Han Solo has. Who, which backbling is who's actually? Let's have a look. So it must be it's Luke Skywalker's backbling. Okay, this one here. So this this one here is Luke Skywalker's back. Luke Skywalker's backbling is pretty cool. It's, the white works very nicely with his outfit. Pickaxe is Electro Staff, which works very nicely once again. It's also as part of the original trilogy set. So I'm pretty sure this is Luke Skywalker's one, or in his bundle. Nope, it is in the Han Solo and Leia bundle. So either way, I picked up both, and I really do like it. And obviously, I now currently own all these Star Wars skins, and they obviously have decided to release something new. And the wrap I'm using is Shadow Seal, which is from Chapter 2, Season 2's Battle Pass. And I may just wrap this on for the blacks at this stage. I wasn't really too sure what wraps to use. And let's move on to the final combo for this one. I decided to pop to use the logo, a go-go. And I'm using oh, and I'm using the team Philadelphia Eagles. You can also whack on the Las Vegas Raiders. They work very nicely also. And I guess you could probably get away with maybe you could get away with the cheaters actually. The Jacksonville Jaguars, sorry. I just whacked on any team. I don't personally support any of the NFL teams. I don't watch it. So just, if you want, you can whack on whatever team you like the NFL wise. But I don't personally watch it. It's just not, you know, the biggest in my country. But, you know, obviously I know a lot of people love the NFL. So obviously I just whacked on the Philadelphia Eagles solely for the white and the black. I know there's a bit of a blue. I was going to use the Raiders, but I decided to get the Eagle. So I found the emblem or the logo looks pretty cool. And that's why I decided to whack it on. Pickaxe is a Shadow Slicer. And the wrap I'm using is the Shadow Angler Shift. So that's all the 10 skin combos done for the Aida level up quest pack skin. And you know, I really do like this skin. I'd say it's probably one of the top ones. I'd probably say my favourite quest pack would probably have to be probably the Omega Knight, then this one, then probably the Monarch. And I'd probably say the Phantasm, which is one from last season, probably the bottom. It's not a bad skin, the Phantasm. I just prefer the pickaxe over the skin. But yeah, so if there is any, if there is any other videos like you see, like skin combos, pickaxe combos, backbling combos, series combos. Obviously, I've been recently doing different series combos. Obviously, I've most recently done Star Wars series, which was yesterday. I've done DC, I've done Marvel, I've done Icon, I've done gaming. I've also done legendary skin combos, epic skin combos, uncommon skin combos, or rare skin combos, and also uncommon. And obviously, if there is any specific ones you'd like to see at skins, you know, it could just be anything. I don't really mind anything Fortnite related, and I'm totally down to get it done. It could be something completely new. And yeah, I don't really mind. But yeah, I'm really enjoying it. So I've got this one done. I've also got the crew pack to make skin combos for, which is this one. Where's it to? The, oh, the Inquisitor. It's quite a cool, unique looking skin. Yeah, I reckon it'll be quite hard to make combos for. And also one of my viewers just for me to make loop sky combos or skin combos. And obviously 10 combos for him. So I will probably be doing that on Monday most likely. And we have the new FNCS skins coming out. So I'll be picking those up and probably getting combos done for those. They are pretty cool. It's like a... The dummy, like a dummy reskin, and it's also a never skin. I can't remember what the ever skin is, but they both look pretty cool. But yeah, so that was pretty decent.